fellow Sudokans, and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Monday the 12th of August 2024, afternoon here in Bangkok. I'm busy doing nothing, nothing the whole day through. Uh, oh, except I did go swimming, that was nice, but um got nothing really to do today. Uh, it's a bank holiday here in Thailand, it's Mother's Day. And so... Uh, uh, but actually, normally when it's a holiday, I've got things to do or I've got work to do in the evening, but it appears actu actually nothing to do at all. So uh, I w was thinking of being creative and, you know, using the time to be creative, maybe uh, pr making some music or something. But no, <laughs> I've just been watching television and snoozing. Uh, but it's going to be a, a, a tough week, I think. So um, I uh, that's OK. Rest is essential. Uh, what's going on in the world? In Greece, not far from Athens, 11 towns have been evacuated, ordered evacuated anyway, including three hospitals. Uh, because of the wildfires that are raging, the pictures are spectacular and scary. Uh, beautiful in a way, but terrifying at the same time. Uh, let's hope the people can avoid injury at the minimum. And let's hope damage can can be kept uh, under control again to a minimum. Good luck, um, people of Greece, a beautiful country. Hey, let's play Sudoku, shall we? This is a, the LA Times expert level puzzle. Fours are blocking across here, giving me a four in that square. That's how I'm going to begin. Fives are blocking across here, and five is blocking down there. That's the second step. And then ones are going across, like so, giving me a one here. So there's a few easy steps to begin with. Let's see how we can go. I'm sure I saw something else from up here, didn't I? Oh, eight, I think. Yeah, there we are. Caught the eight while I was chatting to you. Uh, we've also got eights blocking ac across here and up there, like so. So... We will have eights in those squares at the end. Well, hopefully, won't have to wait till the end to get it. Six blocks here, there's a six. Two completes the row. Two blocks down here and up there for a digit two there. Seven takes care of these two squares, saying, hey, there's a seven down here, nine blocks across here. There is our nine, and the last digit here is, uh, is it six? I think it is. Okay, perhaps, oh no, there's a, oh yes, five up here, five down there, yep, there's something else we can do. Two across here and down there, for a two here, two down here and down there, and two across there. Six blocks down here, giving us six there. We are left here with four and nine, I think. So four blocking all the way to the top there gives us a four in that square. Uh, now this is going to be nine and five. So we've got the five blocking across there. There's our five, there's our nine.
four blocks up here and across there so four is either here or here blocking across four across there four up there here's at four Six across here, six across there. Okay, let's uh, see if I spot anything else by, yes, clicking one down here, one up there, there's a one. One across here, one up there, there's a one. Eight blocks down here, there's the eight, this will be six. Six across here and down here gives us another six. So we're left with sixes in those squares. Don't have any completed digits just yet. Uh, but I see the nine blocking across here. That means that's a nine. This is going to be a seven, and this will be eight. So we do have a complete to do now because 8 is finished.
We might have a tricky ending here. I haven't spotted the answer. Um, no. So there aren't many squares left to put in pencil marks anyway, so I guess we can do it without too much worry. Uh, we're not going to be overloaded. I th there's either this block up there or this block down here, which I think is going to be useful. Uh, let's do this block up here. I'm going to put in all the digits here. Twos go there. Uh, we have three blocking up and th that puts three into these squares, so three blocking across there. I'm going to put threes in those squares. We've got four blocking like this, so we get fours there. <coughs> I know we've got fives going up like this, so we have fives in those squares. Then the only problem is seven. We don't really know anything about sevens, do we? Seven goes there. Hmm. I was hoping I might find something. How about this block down here? Uh, what do we know? The twos are in those squares. Three blocks across, so threes are like this. Four blocks down here, so fours are like that. 6 is in those squares. Ah, oh, no, it's not a pair. Of, no, I looked for that, 3 and 6. It's not that. 7, what do we know? Uh, 7 is in these two squares down here. And that puts it 7 up there. And then 9 blocks down here. So we have uh, 9 in those squares like that. So did we get anything? Yes, we did. We've got a pair of three and six. Okay, so that three is not true then. Let's remove it. And now we know that three is not going to be a three. That's going to be a five. So I was right. It was this block or this block. It was a combination of both of them, actually. That allowed us to move forward a little bit there. Now we've got a pair of two and seven. So that sevens are no longer true. So seven blocks across here. This is going to be a seven 
in that square that's going to be a seven down there and this is not going to be a seven one blocks this square here so that's our one the last number down here is a nine and we have nine blocking up there there's our nine here we still need three three blocks across or oh, three is just the last one there let's do it like that uh, three four we have here so this is going to be a one and this is a five okay last number to place down here is um, six so that's our three that's our six three blocks across there giving me the three in that square and this is a four four across there there's our four the last number here is nine we still need a four there uh, that means four goes there three is there uh, let's get rid of those fours there Uh, right, what are we left with? Uh, seven, nine. Nine blocking there. That's our uh, seven in that square. So there's the two. There's the nine. Seven there, two there. Seven in this square. And a three finishes the game. So pretty straightforward puzzle. Easy. Then there's a little kink at the end where you need to work something out uh, simple to do with a few pencil marks or for those of you who prefer to use your memory or muscle brain muscle uh, you could do it in a different way that's it thank you bye bye